Hello beautiful people, I hope you guys are all doing well. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I blend my natural hair and all about this kinky, curly goddessness. Can you tell that I'm feeling myself a bit? I absolutely love this hair. I'm in, I'm in love. I'm in absolute, no, I'm in love. Love, like the love museum, we're in love. <laughs> returning subscriber thank you for coming back if you're new hi my name is Bill Michelle I do fashion videos as well as hair videos like today's videos and I vlog my travels here and there I hope by the end of this video you're convinced to subscribe or you might just want to subscribe now get ahead of yourself you know early bird gets the worm first in the race all that good stuff so in today's video I'm gonna talk about my lovely lovely afro curly curly hair that I have been rocking recently on Instagram that you guys have loved by the way if you're not following me on Instagram what are you doing I think you should I post quite regularly a lot of travel content on there and fashion content so I think you'll like it so this hair that I've been rocking is actually I'm going ahead of myself I've already taken it out of the bag let me put it back in to make it look all nice and like neat <laughs> okay so this hair is from curls kinks and co and I actually got this when I went to Atlanta no did I get this in Atlanta or North Carolina no I got this in North Carolina so I went to the USA last year to celebrate Eid with my sisters. I hope that Ramadan this year is going well for you. And this is basically what the Americans call an instant weave. And honestly, it is an instant weave, especially if you are natural. This is definitely an instant weave. And it's basically kind of like crocheted hair. With this hair, it's better to actually shake it out than run your fingers through it so you don't disturb the curls. And once I've shaken it out, this is what you have. You have this really, really lovely curls, kind of like crochet curls. And I got it in a a color too and honestly this hair is so 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 gorgeous and every time I've worn it I've gotten so many compliments about the curl pattern and about how natural it looks the inside is also very well constructed you've got the combs and then you've also got the sensational collection instant weave tag and I like the fact that it's not on like a wig cap it's on these like elastic strip type things which means that because it is curly hair with curly hair it can get really really hot in your hair because there's a lot of hair there and it's just, it's just covering a lot of circumference but um yeah i like when wigs are made um on these strands because it just makes the wig more airy and lets your hair breathe underneath so today i'm literally going to be showing you how i style the hair how i blend it in with my own natural hair so this is my natural hair i have cane rolls going all the way back and this is how i usually do my hair if i'm wearing wigs or anything like that so first thing is i'm actually going to curl my hair now there's two ways you can actually curl your hair depending on your hair type and also depending on your hair density you can either do a flat twist i will link some really good flat twist tutorials in the description bar below or you can curl it with a curler which is what i'm going to do today because i actually forgot to do a flat twist for this video i like to limit the amount of heat that i put on my hair because it can have an effect on your curl pattern so the only thing i've done to my hair before this video is i've just slicked down a few baby hairs and i've done somewhat of a parting but because this is a curly hair i didn't want like a straight and very um sort of clean parting i wanted it to be sort of a rough parting if you see me looking this way it's because my mirror is here so yeah i wanted sort of a rough parting um which is literally what i've done there and i'm using my babyliss keratin shine curler this is literally the best curler i would say for afro hair because it does have the um keratin infused wad and also it heats up so so quickly so i've literally just plugged it in and it's already hot i should be using a glove i should have prepped for this video a bit better but it was kind of improvisation because i'm going out today and someone asked me on my instagram to do this video so i thought oh let me do it today so i haven't got everything i need but yeah if you are going to use this type of wand do you use a glove but um in this instance i'm only curling the front of my hair so it'll be fine so i have a mirror here and i have a mirror here I should have a mirror down there but because of where my tripod is there's no mirror there so if you see me looking in this direction or here I'm looking at my two mirrors and I'm going to use the end bit because my hair is um, the hair at the front of my head is fine and it's quite short oh that is such a struggle curl right there but this this will help with the blendability so it's fine okay these two look like struggle curls right now but when I blend it with the hair it will look good okay that looks like less of a struggle curl alhamdulillah usually if I'm curling like my Caucasian hair wigs 
I would clip the curls but because my curl my hair kind of holds a curl pretty well and I'm curling away from my face and I love this about my hair like you know when you're curling um, Caucasian wigs like the silky hair you have to hold your hand here look I can literally just leave my hair there there we go yes no more struggle curls come oh don't burn all right so these are my curls they look like struggle curls right now <laughs> but that's because like I said my hair is very fine especially in the um is this the perimeter in the front of my hair um i'm gonna spray some got to be on there just because um this is really good if you want your curls to last for quite a long time i don't want to have to recurl my hair again tomorrow so i want the curls to stay for at least three days until i actually change my hairstyle so then i'm gonna take the wig and literally just use the combs i love these combs i love a wide comb and i also like the fact that the combs aren't they're not that metal comb that really can really damage your hair i'm just gonna walk out my house like this what's this flat thing going on okay Ooh. Ugh. so another thing i actually like to do is spray some god to be on the actual wig and this is just to maintain the curls and to make sure that they um, stick with each other. Okay, I'm going to need to open my window. I've got a forest in the M4 right behind my house, but with all this hairspray, I had to open the window. I can't come and kill myself for YouTube audio. And I'm also going to use my L'Oreal LV Extraordinary Oil. You don't actually have to do this, but I just want to give some sheen to the hair. I'm also going to put some here. And then I'm going to go on to blending everything. Okay, and what I'm doing now is I'm taking my hair and I'm just blending it into some of the curls that are at the front. So I'm taking each individual one that I curled and just blending it in. And this wig is actually a bit, a tad bit lighter than my natural hair. And because I've worn this a few times, I'm actually going to trim some of the edges just where it's gone a bit bushy like here. It's literally like a fur ball, so might as well just chop that away. And that, my friends, is it. I know, see me is difficult. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. I'm going to put all the details of this hair in the description bar below. Like I said before, I got this when I was in the US, so I'm going to try and see if I can find a direct link to the hair. If not, I'll try and see if I can find something similar, but I love this hair, especially for summer. I said it on my Instagram, curly hair is my comfort place, but curly hair takes so much maintenance, but that's why I love a synthetic curly wig. But the only thing is, you have to be careful with the type of synthetic curly wig you get because you could end up looking like one of them african aunties no disrespect to the aunties i love i love my african aunties you guys hold a special place in my heart but let's be honest there's a typical curly wig that the african aunties wear and it's just uh I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope it was helpful. I hope you have a good morning, evening, afternoon or whatever time you watch this video. And if you're not already subscribed, you've got to the end of this video. I think you want to subscribe by now. So click the subscription button. It's free. We like free stuff. And we're such a lovely family here. Bye. Got you effortlessly. That's the way. It was happened so naturally. I did not know it was love. Next thing I saw was you pulling me close. What am I gonna do? I needed someone. And now we're flying through the stars. Hope this night will last forever. Ha 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 ha. Hey, oh, 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 God. Party done.